to run. <laughs> and you're scared to run away. Yeah. That's is, a cool track. Yeah. Is it true that those are your eyes on the cover of Innocent Victim? Yes. Yes. Interesting. <laughs> That's one day when I didn't have a drink. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I, I, um, I, got, I was playing in, in St. Louis in um, Muddy Waters, playing in a gig there with the Dry Heap. Mm-hmm. And Tony Iommi and Giza Butler came up and uh, asked me to <laughs> join them then. With uh, Tony Iommi and, the, and singing, and uh, they came to see me and just said, "Can we have you in the band?" It's always the same way. Isn't it? I'm in a, I'm in a band that I love, and someone else comes to take me away from it. Wow! <laughs> but no, <laughs> I wouldn't leave. I wouldn't leave you right. That was that was my baby. Wow! Tony Iommi asked actually asked you to play drums. Yeah, Tony asked me if, he, if I joined with Black Sabbath. They've got um, they um, they got uh, Don uh, uh, Dio. Ronnie Dio. Oh, yeah. And I said, that's a great honor. It's a lovely honor for you to ask me, but I'm so set in your eye heat. We're just about to, re- you know, record another album, which looks like it's going to go well. Yeah. And that was Abominog. Yeah, Abominog. I love that. Yeah. I loved it. Well, I, it, was, I lo- it was yeah. such a great album. I mean, the thing is, all the tracks were good we wrote. We had some good ideas. Yeah. And we were fearless, you know. Yeah, I, I also love the song, Think It Over. Yeah. Oh, Think- that was great, Trevor's. That's the one I told him when I heard it. I said, "You got to, you should have that with a whole orchestra, whole thing." It's yes. a brilliant song. Let's talk about your time with Ozzy Osbourne. Go on then. What What are your favorite memories of Randy Rhodes? I loved him to bits. I enjoyed him. He was a genius at what he did. I had the pleasure of being, you know, the drummer in the band with Bob, and we, me, Randy, and Bob had a magic. There's no question, a magic. To what um, yeah, Ra- definitely. he never understood. Well, wow. in his chair and his wife. And I'd write an idea for one of the songs, but a uh, guitar solo. And he'd go, That is so cool. And he'd play it and say, That's just what it needs. You know, that's how open we were. Wow. Bob would say to, say to me, Why don't I play this on this track, drums? I'd go, Yeah, okay, that's cool. And I'd, and I'd go to him, Why don't we both do that? You, we do the rundown. You play the same rundown as I play on the drums. And he'd go, Yeah, okay. That was what it was all about. Wow. Total respect. Yeah. We I, just, I mean, if it wasn't, I got thrown, told, kicked out with Bob, but I did because I told her, you know, he's not going to do two, he doesn't want to do two, and she just said, I'm the manager, you do what I say. Oh, God. No, you're not. <laughs> in, the, in the contract, you work for me, and that was it. She hated me after that. Wow. I'll give her I'll never wow. give her. Yeah, that's terrible. Yeah, it is. And people, I hope people realize what a nasty ASA she is. Well, um, I'm going to ask you one more question. But Go ahead, as far, as far as other drummers, did you ever hang out with Keith Moon? or Mooney, yeah. I had a, cool. I knew him reasonably well in the early days. We used to have some fun together. Nice. Nice. Yeah. yeah well, I mean, we, used to, we always used to stay at the Riot House. So did he. The Riot uh, House in L.A., right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah that, that's that's also, fam- also famous for Led Zeppelin. Yeah, it was Led Zeppelin, you're right, he, Stones. Well, cool. Stones didn't let you. Did you love or hate disco at that time? Sorry? Did you love or hate disco at that time? I, I respected it because it was so successful. Mm-hmm. And it was all, and, and anywhere you went, you'd hear that, you know, you know, you, uh, uh, you're the one that I want, ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, you'd, <laughs> yeah. You know, you'd accept, accept it for what it was. So, yeah, I yeah. don't knock success. I don't, I didn't particularly like it. But it was it was where it was and what yes. it was. A nice. new form of music everybody latched on to. Nice. And the Bee Gees went huge with it, didn't they? Mm-hmm. Did, did you ever hang out with them? Or? Uh, yeah, well, a couple of times for breakfast down in, in um, the, the Ryan House. Oh, nice. To meet Barry and, and uh, yeah, Barry Gibb. 